So, uh, this engine did not come with a starter. Um, I can't remember if I explained this in one of the other videos, but when I picked up the engine, it didn't have a starter. I asked him if he had the starter. He said he'd sell it to me for 50 bucks. And for whatever stupid reason, I was just like, yeah, I'm good. I don't know why on earth I didn't just give him another 50 bucks for the starter. Because I've been having a heck of a time trying to find a starter for this engine. Um, I've tried contacting the guy too and saying, hey, you know, 50 bucks still for that starter. And I haven't, it's gone nowhere and it's been like two and a half months now. So, went to eBay, bought a starter. Um, that wasn't the right one. It just, it spun the engine, but it sounded awful. Something wasn't meshing up properly. So sent that back, got another one. So I've now had a 10 and a 12 tooth starter. And in this video, I'm using the 12 tooth starter. And um, you, it's kind of hard to tell from the video, but it still just isn't quite right. And uh, I pulled the starter back out and you can see it's only, the tooth is only engaging like a 16th of an inch into the flywheel. So I'm just having a heck of a time finding the starter for this thing. I think I got it figured out though. 